Hello and welcome back to my Pokemon Emerald Randomizer Nuzlocke. Um, so in the last episode we found out what the options for our three starters were, which was Cubone, Gulpin and Latios. Um, I did a straw poll and you guys voted. I did actually already film a bit of this episode and we had a little bit of a problem. So Cubone won the straw poll. Um, I chose Cubone and the only moves it knew was Tau Whip and growl. Now I don't know if there was a box I was meant to tick in the the setup or whatnot, but um, obviously I can't beat my rival if that's the case and can't progress in the game. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pick the second most voted for Pokemon, which was Golpin. It's kind of a kick in the teeth for me because it means that my rival will get Latios, which is super annoying. Um, but you know, obviously you want to keep this going. So, without further ado, let's, uh, let's get into it. That's so annoying. Why couldn't you have known some better moves? Why? Why do you have to... Why do you have to go to me? Come on, Gulpin, let's do it. I actually thought this was going to be randomized, but apparently it's not. The good thing is, we can beat it this time! <laughs> there we go, beautiful. Woo! I was in the tall grass studying wild Pokemon when I was jumped. You saved me, thanks a lot. Oh, hi, you're Sam. This is not the place to chat, so come, some, come by my Pokemon lab later, okay? Okie dokie. So, Sam, I've heard so much about you from your father. I've heard that you don't have your own Pokemon yet. But the way you battled earlier, you pulled it off with aplomb. <laughs> I don't know how to pronounce that. <laughs> I guess you have your father's blood in your veins after all. Ah, uh, yes. As thanks for rescuing me, I'd like you to have the Pokemon you used earlier. There we go. We got our starter. While you're at it, why not give it a nickname to that gulpin? I didn't think about nicknames. Hmm. If you work a Pokemon again experience, I think you'll make an extremely good trainer. My kid May is also studying Pokemon while helping me out. Sam, I think it might be a good idea to go see May. Great, May should be very happy too. Get May to teach you what it means to be a trainer. Thank you. So now we have to go up uh, to the route up ahead and battle May. And hopefully, we'll be able to beat it this time if Latios doesn't kill us first. What do you have to say? Our well, Pokemon will jump out at you in tall grass. If you want to catch Pokemon, you have to go into tall grass and search. Right, so obviously we don't, the Nuzlocke doesn't technically start until we have Pokeballs, so it's okay for us to encounter something. If anyone gets tired, take him to the Pokemon Center. There's a Pokemon Center in Oldale, right close by. Thank you. And um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to buy some potions in the Pokemart because I am genuinely scared about this Latios. Uh, that should be alright. I don't want to buy too many um, because I want to buy balls later. Uh, and I don't want to buy too little because I don't want Latios to kill my Gulpin. Nice, we didn't get an encounter anyway. Awesome. Let's see, the Pokemon found on Route 103 includes... Oh, hi, Sam. Oh, I see my dad gave you a Pokemon as a gift. Since we're here, let's have a quick battle. I'll give you a taste of what being a trainer is like. Our first trainer battle, here we go. Why couldn't I have had you? Oh, it's sad because now Cubone is kind of like gone. No one, no one has him. never see the poor guy again. Psy wave. Should be. Yeah, we're fine. Okay. Ah, oh, come on, swole. Should be alright. I think. I think with our potions, we'll be okay. 
Oh, thank God. Oh my God. Jeez, swole. Beating down a Latios. Right, I'm going to take a potion because I don't want to take any chances. Obviously. I think all it knows is Psy Wave, so I think we'll be alright. Alright, a few more. Maybe two, three more. Can we get another miss? Ah, uh, yeah, we'll go with it. We'll go for it. We're fine. Awesome. There we go. Swole, look at you beating legendaries. Jeez, Sonya's his second battle. He's beating down a Latios. Level six. Awesome. And he learned Yawn. I didn't know he learned it that early. That'll come in super useful. God, the levels. Level A. Whew. Well, that's great, Sam. You're pretty good. If I do say so myself. I think I know my dad has an eye out for you now. I mean, you just got that Pokemon, but it already likes you. You might be able to befriend any kind of Pokemon easily. Well, it's time to head back to the lab. Let's go. Sam, over here. Let's hurry home. I'll be there in a sec. Oh, hi, Sam. I heard you beat May on your first try. That's excellent. May's been helping me with my research for a long time. May has an extensive history as a Pokemon train already. Here, Sam. I ordered this in my research, but I think you should have this. Pokedex, awesome. Pokedex is a high-tech tool that automatically makes a record of any Pokemon you meet or catch. My kid May goes everywhere with it. Whenever my kid catches a rare Pokemon and records it stayed from the Pokedex, why, May looks at me while I'm out doing field work and shows me. Oh, wow, Sam, you got a Pokedex too. That's great, just like me. I've got something for you too. There we go, our Pokeballs. So now, we can start building our team. Sam put away the Pokeballs in the Pokeball pocket. It's funny if you can get a lot of Pokemon. I'm going to look all over the place because I want different Pokemon. If I find any cute Pokemon, I'll catch them with Pokeballs. Sweet. Thank you, guys. See you later, after talking to our mum. Sam, Sam, did you introduce yourself to Professor Birch? Oh, what an adorable Pokemon you got from Professor Birch. How nice. You're your father's child, alright. You look good together with Pokemon. Here, honey. If you're going out on an adventure, wear these running shoes. I'll put a zip in your step. Awesome, now we can run. Yep, yep. Awesome. To think that you have your very own Pokemon now. Your father will be overjoyed. But please, be careful. If anything happens, you can come home. Go on. Go get them, honey. <laughs> Thanks, Mum. Let's have a look at uh, the Sculpin. Stench. Oh, so that, that would explain why we uh, we didn't get any encounters. So that could actually come in useful if we want to save our encounters for, for something. He's holding a Moo Moo Milk. What a legend. <laughs> what a legend. He was just chilling holding a Moo Moo Milk. Right. Let's see. That was quicker than I thought it would be. Spinarak. I mean, I'll take it. I'll take. I'll take anything. I'll take anything at this point. Could be worse. Could be a lot worse. An area dose could be cool in the team, actually. Oh, almost killed it. Almost misclicked and uh, killed it as well. Awesome, awesome. Our first catch. The web it spins can be considered its second nervous system. It is said that spinner spin stomach is sprayed by the tiny vibrations it builds through the web. Given a nickname. Um, let's go with... Bugs. There we go. 
Right now, I'd really like to be able to go and heal in the Pokemon Center. Thank you. Thank you very much. Alright, what else could we have got? We could have got like a Dabra! Ah. Oh. I would have taken a Kadabra. Right, let's buy some more balls. Yeah, I don't want to use too much money. There we go. Right. Again, quite a quick encounter. A Lickitung! I mean, I'll take it, I'll take a Lickitung. I mean, I have to take it. Don't lick me. So don't lick me! One more pound. Sweet. Let's get this guy. Nice, there we go. Second encounter. Whenever it sees something unfamiliar, it always licks the object because it memorizes things by texture and taste. It is somewhat put off by sour things. Right, I want what do we call this guy? <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna ask my girlfriend for a name suggestion. I'll be one second. Right, her first response was, uh, ew. <laughs> but then she said, uh, uh, Kevin. So I guess, I guess we'll, we'll go with Kevin. And, uh, good old Kev. There we go. Right, what else could we have got? Getting really weirdly quick encounters now all of a sudden. Another lick song, fairs. Constant liquor tongues, apparently. It's probably like the. I need to get Wingo on this route. Like the Wingo of the route or something. Bay Leaf? We could have got a Bay Leaf? That would have been awesome! Wow. It's all good. It's all good. Right. Wait, don't you give me something. Hi, I work at Pokemon. Can I get you to come with me? This is a Pokemon Mart. Just look for our blue roof. We sell a variety of goods including Pokeballs for catching Pokemon. Here, I'd like you to have this as a promotional item. Fair enough, there we go. Got free potion. Can't argue with that. A Pokemon can be used at any time, so it's even more useful in a Pokemon Center in certain situations. In certain situations. Thank you very much. I finished sketching the footprints of a rare Pokemon, but it turns out they were only my own footprints. Oh, he's, um, he's covering that bit before, isn't he? Because he's like, oh, there's a rare Pokemon around here. I can see its footprints. Route 102. So we can get another encounter here, which would be lovely. All right, let's take a look at our, our two guys. Fuck, shed skin heals the body by shedding. Decent, decent. And he has an attacking move. <laughs> All right, let's have a look at Kev. Uh, changes type to foe's move. Ah, uh, that could that could come in handy. I'm just happy that we have attacking moves. <laughs> Don't want another Cubone situation. If you have Pokemon with you, then you're an official Pokemon trainer. You can't say no to my challenge. Let's go, boy. 
Youngster Calvin, far fetched. Nice. Uh, let's put it to sleep. There we go. Poison gas, awesome. I got coming pretty handy. Listen, you. If you're strong, you should have told me before. I'm sorry. Right, shall we get our encounter? Right, I like the bit of grass behind this guy. This looks good to me. Here we go. A, s a slacking! Please, please say we can catch this guy. Please. Go to sleep. Oh. Here's a wait. Mm. Well, it's fine. We can use your one uh, before we go to sleep, so that's all good. <sighs> come on. Ah, oh, come on! Yes! Yes! Slacking! That is sick! That is actually awesome! Hordes of slacking gather around trees when fruits come into season. They wait around patiently for rival fruits to fall out of the trees. Ah! Oh, wow! Wow! So we can do better than that. We can do better than that. Kingston. There we go. Kingston. Kings. Kingston. Yeah. Kingston. Awesome. Wow. I am so happy with that. I am so happy with that. Illuminate. Encounter rate increases. It's basically uh, just a, a complete counter to to swall, and he has moves. <laughs> Bold. Okay, so he's got uh, he's got increased defense, which is which is awesome. Decreased attack, but we can we can we can work around it. We can work around it. Okay, let's continue with these trainers. Ha ha, our eyes meet. I'll take you on with my bug Pokemon. I don't think he's actually going to have any bug Pokemon though. Yeah, Grompic. That doesn't look like a bug to me, dude. Well, I did have Psybeam too. What's everyone doing with Psybeam? Okay, I'm pretty sure I had two Pokemon. Level 10, nice. Swole is getting swole! Bayonet. Yes. I don't know who can take it. You know, we'll put it to sleep. We'll put it to sleep. Nice, so we've got it poisoned. Uh, did it go to sleep? We should heal. Then we're just gonna have to kind of uh, stay with it until it, uh, it goes down to the poison. Let's try and get it to sleep.
Come on. Whew. It killed itself. <laughs> oh, I'm down and out. That actually kind of scared me. I was actually worried there with Bayonet. If you look guys with a trainer, you have to challenge it. It's a rule. If it had got that curse on earlier, um, maybe we could have been in a little bit of trouble. The poison was definitely useful there. Like healing up after like every battle. Thank you, Nestroy. Definitely gonna have to train these guys. We'll get through these trainers first. I'm not very tall, so I sink right into tall grass. The grass goes up my nose. Fwah, 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 fwah. All right, what else do we have got? Another slacking. <laughs> Fair enough. It's the late, it's a field of slackings. Did not see you there. You just become a trainer. We're both beginners. What have you got? Cloister. It's crazy because you see all these like moves, but you forget that they're the same level as you. Awesome. Level 11. This guy is leveling. Seeking. Uh. We'll stay in. We'll stay in. Because Swole's the only guy who can really do anything at this point. We need to level the other dudes up. Sweet. I called you because I thought I could beat you. I haven't won once yet. I wish I'd win soon. Don't worry, dude. Don't worry. Let's get some berries. Two arm berries, awesome. I think we do get a thing to like plant and. Okay, so. I guess we'll just plant them back again and then we come back at some point. Isn't there something you can get to water them? This was always like my favorite bit of grass that I would spend ages in because uh, you could you could get Ralts and Ralts is like one of my favorite Pokemon ever. I'm going to catch a whole bunch of Pokemon. Right, so I'm gonna end this episode here. We now have four members in our team: um, Swole, the Golpin, Bugs, the Spinarak, Kevin, the Lickitung, and Kingston, the Slacking. Um, I'm going to level these guys up a little bit. I might put a little montage in. Um, but thank you so much for watching. And I will see you in the next part when we continue on to Petalburg. I'll see you there. Peace. Oh my god! There was a Rayquaza! What? <laughs> oh, wow. Yeah, that's a bit more like what I was expecting. There we go, our entire team two level six. That should be uh, that should be good for now. Peace.